video inspection of a Citizen M20. This is a 3M3 Series, uh, series 3 Type 3. It has a cab 20 MIS bar loader, 12 foot capacity, all the service tools, Mistbuster, fire suppression, all the live tools for the gang tool, turning tools for Gibbs, back working tree, guide bushing, sub spindle, turret. This machine is in excellent working condition, very, very well maintained. Looking down the bar loader, this machine has a eight line cool blaster with filtration. Serial number. NSK system for high speed drilling. This is an AL951 NSK air drill filtration. Okay, let's let's, get, let's go with the RPMs. We're gonna start out at what RPM? Uh, 2,500. This is gonna be 2,500 on the main spindle. I'm about seven inches from the spindle. This is the guide bushing. I'm about five inches from the guide bushing. Yes, sir. about two inches away from the guide bushing. The secret is rotary guide bushing. Okay, can you turn that up to about 5,000? Uh, I'd have to go back in and reset it. Okay, we'll do that again in a minute. How about the sub spindle? And this is the sub spindle. Again, I'm about two inches away from the sub spindle. Okay, let's move the machine. Are you have a system or program or are you going to run it and cycle it? Uh, move the substance on and out, and then we'll... Okay, go manual and just go ahead and move the machine and move the sub. This machine is very tight. Ball screws and everything has been checked out regularly. This is a medical manufacturing site. And you want to move it in the X? Yep. Yep, no problem. or the Z, either way. Again, I'm about five inches from the turret. Okay, and the gang tools. are super quiet. Physically I can't even hear it with my ear. Okay, can you turn on the spindles on that? Live 
tools are going at, right, and at what RPM? Uh, 1500. Is that 1500? I'm about two inches away from the spindles. And I'm about two inches away from the gearbox. And the spindle is going inside of the turret. This is the driven tools. You can see the gears are moving inside. Okay. And can you cycle the bar feed? Can you do that from here? Oh. Rotate the turret? Yes, yeah, that would be great. Sorry, we're going to rotate the turret, show you the indexing. I never stand on the side of it. It's fine. couple is very quiet. Okay, let's go. Can we do the bar feed? Can you cycle that or pull it back? Or just so I can see the chains moving back and forth? Oh yeah, no problem. So this is a cab loader with the guide rollers in the front. This is the porch. This is the remnant retract section. And there's the pusher. Chains moving in the back, getting prepared. There's the pusher coming forward. You want me to load a bar? Is yeah, you can. can. Bar? No, no, you can just just go forward and back. We just want to see that the functionality is there. This is the adjustment for the different diameters of bars that you're running with. Just roll these over to the next location. And currently it's set up at, looks like a eight millimeter bar. Sorry, it looks like it's currently set up at a 16 millimeter. Okay, yep, go ahead. Okay. That was the stabilizer opening and closing. Do that one more time. Okay, that concludes the inspection of the Citizen M20 Type 3. Yeah.